Hey guys, how's it going? And welcome back to another Week in Review. I hope you guys are enjoying all these uh, Instagram stories that I'm posting on YouTube. Quick caveat, and if you really, really, really want to see these in the most awesome possible angle, try to watch them on your phone, try to watch them on your tablet or what have you so you can actually get the better angle and don't have like those weird bars on the side and all that good stuff. But regardless, guys, thank you so much for joining me as always. Um, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the show and uh, I'll see you guys uh, at the end of it. Enjoy. Back to live streaming. Talking about patents and Satoshi. Talking a lot about crypto. This Thursday night, next Thursday night, and every Thursday and Monday night. Okay, from now on. So please join us while we talk about crypto and other things that are happening around the world. What are you waiting for? I'm waiting on you. Where are you? I don't see you. Oh, you already know what time it is. It's in the morning because I don't even have my shirt on and I'm definitely, definitely making me some coffee. It's Friday morning, baby. Let's get this baby rolling. Video that I uploaded just a couple hours ago, then yesterday's video that had over 24 hours of watch time. I'm not going to give up on that podcast thing. I'm just going to rework it and rework it and rework it until somebody likes it. I'm already uploading the video for... Today, well not today, but for the weekend and all that good stuff and uh, like literally it's like not even 9 in the morning and I already have over, I have more views on today's video. Happy Memorial Day. Hope everyone out there is having a wonderful, awesome America Day. Having your barbecues and doing all that good stuff. I'm here in Mexico and I'm just celebrating Monday. You know, I honestly wanted to be here for you guys this weekend but I'm gonna be honest with you oh, my weekend was so fucking insane <laughs> I, I mean I'm, I'm barely here <laughs> let me give you a little context and explain so you know as you guys already know um, this fr well you guys don't know so on Friday I helped my girl move she moved from one house to another whatever we do that shit all the time but on Saturday um, she goes to me hey um, my friends are throwing a party um, you wanna come let's go hang out blah 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 I'm like fuck yeah let's do it and about 78 billion beers later, we woke up. Well, actually, we didn't even get home till like fucking 6, 7 in the morning the next day and went to sleep God knows when. And holy shit, yesterday was a hangover of all hangovers. And uh, I'm kind of recovering today. But, man, Mexicans drink like a motherfucker. And it's so awesome. Great fucking time. I love Mexico. They sure can drink. <laughs> well, I'm going to see if I can head out to the store. I got to go run a few errands before it gets like a billion degrees outside. And oh, by the way, do you guys see some new art I got? Look, I got more new art over here too. I'm just full of art. That's the only thing I'm full of. Yeah, that's not the only thing this guy's full of. Trust me, he's full of a lot of... Excuse me? You are saying something? Yeah, I was saying you're full of shit, you fucking Cuban fucking whatever you are. I walk into the Walmart right now and it's like still not it's like 10 30 in the morning maybe earlier and fuck it's freezing in here fuck it was uh, actually pretty cold just standing under the shade um, even though I'm still sweating it's only because I haven't done anything any kind of workout in like I don't know I want to say since like last Thursday so almost a week ish and um, it's humid even though it's cooler and I'm a fat fuck and I just sweat a lot but still it's um, I'm fucking freezing my ass off in here like I hope I don't get a cold. So, yeah, I mean, a common question I get asked that all the time is like, man, you know, you seem so hot out there, man. Um, I don't know if I can, you know, we're just talking about the heat and the weather all the time. But it's like, again, to me, 
like yeah sure it's really really hot for a few months out of the year but i think that's pretty much anywhere you are because even when i was in seattle and it was cold as fuck when it would be warm for a few days it was really 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 hot because you're just not used to it so i'm just used to the heat over the cold so that's why i can literally survive out here a lot better and a lot nicer because it's i grew up in miami florida which is like 10 billion times hotter than it is here so to me this is pretty fucking awesome you know like honestly and i do have ac i have air conditioner i just only use it at night like why i mean i got fucking fresh air all the time why why not use that you know why you know breathe in the mechanical ac and or whatever the hell it comes out of that when uh, i got fresh air and um, i can just do that every day all right i gotta get going they're calling me i gotta do something I gotta sign a paper not quite sure just finished another successful game of walmart tetris yeah i added an extra bag because you know i'm fancy like that i just realized i gotta shave this little area here all right i gotta go see you later rain slowly but surely it's coming down it's not cooling off yet just uh humid and hot but hopefully soon oh i really do hope everyone's having an awesome memorial day out there i actually am pre having a great one too um I've been trying to work and do stuff, but, you know, again, I keep getting interrupted. It was a little bit after I got home, I had a visitor come over. We were hanging out, you know, literally till like a few minutes ago, and I just realized how late it is, like 5 p.m. already. So it's like, day's pretty much gone. And I'm um, still kind of getting over my hangover from this weekend. So, yeah, you know, I did, I did get to do some work after all. But I think I am going to end up just chilling out for the rest of the night and uh just like everybody else and why not we all deserve a day off a holiday and all that good stuff right right all right guys <laughs> good morning everybody how's everybody doing out there hope you guys had an amazing memorial day weekend but now it's back for the grind it's back to coffee time Look at that. Look at that beautiful awesomeness. Mmm. Yes. 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 The nectar of the gods. Alrighty, so I've already um, shot and edited two videos so far today. See, you got Lambo helping me out over there. He's behind the information desk shooting me um, all kinds of information. You know how like Joe Rogan has Jamie? Hey Jamie, can you pull that up real quick? So while I'm filming my episodes, I got uh, Mr. Lambo helping me out, my assistant. So yeah, so now I'm about to talk about Venezuela, Russia, Cuba, China, all that good stuff. Not uh, an awful lot of our international power comes from the fact that the dollar is the standard unit of international uh, finance and transactions. <laughs> Buy Bitcoin. Anyways, how's your day going? You can see I'm working, doing a lot of shit, eating shit. Man, you know, today's been one of those rare days where um, I've been doing so much work, like literally done so much, you know, we've done a lot of videos and a bunch of other shit too. And, you know, every time I look at the clock, it seems like the clock is you know just going super slow you know tickety talk which is great because a lot of times you know when you're doing a lot of stuff it time just disappears but seems like today just the stars are aligning look at that look at that guy he's trying to align himself behind me you gotta be careful with him hey how's it going good morning guys sorry i'm running a little late as you guys can see i'm a little busy and i'm still trying to get my show ready so I'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, I got my shirt on, I got Lambo ready, and now I'm about to go and start doing my show. I know, I get easily distracted. As you guys can see, it's hard not to get distracted. Mm, I need coffee. Hey guys, well, I'm hard at work again. You guys can see, I got a new video coming up today. Yeah, I usually don't upload the same day I do a live stream on uh, but there's some breaking news, believe it or not. 
Um, I had a video that I was going to post in a few days about Julian Assange and today I just literally found out a few minutes ago that he has been hospitalized. So who the fuck even knows is he, if he's even going to be alive in the next few days. So uh, I had to re-edit my video and um, I'm finishing up the exporting now so that I can upload it and it should be up on the YouTube's uh, about 30 minutes give or take. Seems like no one's uh, been talking about this. There's no breaking news on this shit yet so it might be the first one. I hope. Hey guys, how's it going? Well, I'm re-editing a video I was going to post in a few days because I actually made a video talking about Julian Assange I was going to post, I don't know, in the next few days or what have you. And um, I just found out like a little while ago uh, some breaking news that it seems like Mr. Assange has been hospitalized and he's not doing very well. You already know what I think about that situation. But regardless, I was like, fuck, I got to re-edit this video real quick and then just see if I can upload it right now, which is something I rarely do. I don't normally upload the same day I do a, a live stream, but this is kind of like breaking news and I got to see if I can jump on this uh, before anyone else does. It seems like it's not out there yet, so only in a few outlets in other languages. So, Well, I should be working, but I'm just kind of like overlooking my video and making sure I didn't say anything too dumb as usual. And uh, see, look, my computer got hijacked. Nothing I can do about this. Lambo's laughing. Man, I'm sure glad I uploaded that uh, Julian Assange video when I did, because it seems to be blowing up. It's already close to 200 views, and it's only been like a couple hours, so hell yeah. I'm making this video because still busy. Well, I'm back in the office. Back to uploading. Pretty much done. Kind of slow into the month. Got a few projects I gotta start jumping on tomorrow, but it's so hot and humid. Look, I got a dead slug here. Dead slug. You know that uh, Julian Assange video that I actually decided to upload? Man, that thing's blowing up. It's only been a few hours and it's already like close to like 500 views. I feel like I've already told you guys that it's a lot of views. It's a lot of fucking views. It's pretty cool. Look, that's what's making it so fucking hot and humid. These clouds. And it's not raining. It's teasing us. It's darker on that side, too. You know, I've never thought of asking you guys if you guys actually enjoy me drinking coffee. I don't know if you guys have some, some sort of fetish out there of me watching coffee. You just guys just skip through these. Well, I mean, you know, just FYI. I mean, I myself have a little bit of a coffee fetish. As a matter of fact, I love getting you know, raw coffee beans, you know, just like the whole beans and just throwing them on my bed and just rolling around in them. All right, so today is uh, day two of the rain update. Seems like there might be some rain. I actually checked. There actually will be some rain later on today. So I'm gonna get going soon so I can go to it central so I don't get all wet like a wet little ducky. You know, you guys can barely see me. Horrible, horrible. But anyways, yeah, it's kind of cloudy everywhere. I hope it fucking rains. We really need it. Yeah, I know no one asked, but I'm going to tell you. You know that Julian Assange video, the one I was talking to you guys about yesterday, all day long? Well, it, I woke up this morning, it's still not even 24 hours, and it's already at 4,000 views or close to it. Fuck yeah, viral time! Alrighty, well, you already know what time it is. It's time for me and my camera to spend some quality time together. And also for me to fix my hair. Look, look there you go. Now I look a little bit more presentable. Now all I need is a lot more sweat and I'm good to go. Okay, so I think we've accomplished uh, the sweat stains as you guys can see. I got my hair all looking good. I just finished filming an episode, so now let's just uh, sit here and enjoy, uh, you know, the rest of the scenes and shit, you know? Look how beautiful we got here. And just sit here and enjoy a little bit. Look what I got. Look, I got some friends with me here. Look, hanging out with the birds. You already know it. It is so fucking human, man. Like, I'm literally drenched in sweat. And it's like actually not even that hot. It's actually cool, it's windy, but yet I'm drenched in sweat. I'm telling you, humidity is not my friend. Ugh, thank God it's only limited out here. I just came across this uh, sign right here. It literally just translates to, please don't make any noise out here because you know people are trying to do stuff and you know don't be noisy, blah, blah, blah. And uh, you know, when I first used to walk around here, I used to always think that those signs were put up by the locals. But when I was walking with my girlfriend through here the other day, I realized that it's actually the white people or the expats that come here and then they put those signs there for everybody. Yeah, so in short, 
please don't move out here or don't move anywhere and then start imposing your dumbass fucking rules of like don't be noisy and shit like that if you want that then move somewhere that's already not noisy okay because this To me, it was kind of rude because, you know, now that I know that it's the expats, you know, that are coming out here and putting, you know, those signs as to like, oh, please, you know, keep it quiet. Don't be noisy. It's like, no, man, that this, no, just no, bad, bad. Oof, fucking hot as balls today. No, literally, my balls are sticking to my shorts, and I got this uh, stuff called swamp ass. You guys ever have that? Yeah, sucks. So, what are you guys doing tonight? You guys ain't busy. You should join me on BitTube, on D Live, or on Twitch, whichever one you want. I'm gonna be live streaming all three at the same time. For reals. I just have one thing to say. Balls. Particularly this ball. Have you guys ever used one of these things? These things are fucking amazing. You know, uh, for all of a sudden, if you got like to massage your back, you just kind of like do that and it like, fucking helps. It's awesome. For anyone out there that is uh, wondering on how to procrastinate like a professional, I will be uh, having classes um, every Tuesday and Thursday nights at the local rec center here in Merida. All right, for real, seriously, enough, enough time wasting, enough horsing around. Oh, you think that's fucking funny, huh? By the way, guys, I'm not quite sure if I showed you guys these paintings I have laying around the house because I remember I put them up, but I forgot to show you. So here, let me at least uh, give you guys a little bit of a proper showing. So, by the way, you know, these were painted by my girlfriend like a very long time ago, back when she was kind of starting out her career. That's a Lambo, you guys already know him. And then we got this one, and this one was supposed to be laying horizontal like that, like the other one. But I laid it like this because I didn't have much room, and look at that, it looks pretty fucking awesome, right? And then I got this one over here, which was the first thing she ever gave me. It's fucking awesome, huh? I'm telling you guys, tip of the day, get yourself a Mexican girlfriend. Yeah, you could tell I'm definitely killing some time today. All right, I really got no more time to kill. I gotta go shower and get ready because uh, I got the show tonight. But hey, it was nice to have uh, about 15, 20 minutes of free time to do absolutely fucking nothing but eat shit with my phone and have fun with you guys. Hey guys, what's up? How's it going? Lambo's here. Everybody else is here. Are you here? Better join us. We're streaming live on Twitch, BitTube, DLive, the whole night. I'll see you guys in a little bit and every Monday and Thursday, the usual. Hey, what are you guys doing? I'm still live streaming. Hope you guys are having a wonderful uh, night. And if you're bored, you should join us sometime. The links are everywhere. Look, we're watching some guys gold prospecting in the middle of New York City and actually finding gold and diamonds. Who would have thought? Anyway. That's the kind of fun stuff that we do. We talk about all kinds of stuff, you know, crypto, gold and silver, politics, you name it. Anyways, we're always having fun, me and Lambo and the whole gang. And you should join us on one of these nights. Hope you guys are having fun out there. This went already a little too long, so now it's just me and Lambo. Uncomfortable silence. Oh, look, you can see him through my glasses. What the hell? So... What did you guys think of uh, the stories this week? Uh, pretty interesting, huh? Seems like... Uh, this guy, always trying to take the limelight away from me, man. After all the hard work I put into this. No way, man. It was all mine. No, it was me. No, it was me. Okay, so, well, enough of that. Um, thanks again for joining me. I really appreciate you guys. You guys are the fucking best. Don't forget to please like, please subscribe, please share, and uh, I'll see you guys manana. You already know the drill. Peace. Coca-Cola. No Coca-Cola for me. Coca-Cola.
No Coca-Cola for me. Coca-Cola. No Coca-Cola for me.